I might get a 312 off of them or get them booted up. You hear me? And then when they see me on public now, we friends. You know what I'm talking about? All right. So today, y'all. Man, this is some bullshit today, y'all. So I woke up today. I checked my bank account to see how much money was in it today because it was payday for my other job. And I checked my money. I'm like, this shit kind of short. Hold on, y'all got to take my trash out real quick. All right. So I'm back. I'm at the bank right now. Last night, somebody picked up my debit card. And they done went and spent like $266 off my card. I even got the places wrote down of what places they went. Apparently, they stay, I guess, on the south side, look like. So, this is what I'm about to do. I'm about to report the car stolen and all those charges, fraud, get my money back, and I'm about to press charges. I'm about to see what kind of new beef I got going on. So, that's what I'm doing. Right now, I'm at the bank. I'm about to pull the rest of my money out, sit around for a couple of days with my money at the bank. Um, And this is what I'm about to do. I'm about to go make a police report. And I'm going to be honest with y'all. When this type of stuff goes on, make a police report. You're going to sit here and look stupid without your money. I don't give a fuck about no hood shit. When it, time comes and I got to meet up with the person, we could deal with it like that. You ain't going to steal from me, though. That's the thing. You ain't robbed me. You ain't take it from me like hand to hand. You ain't do no thug shit and take, you know what I mean? They ain't take it from me. You hear me? That car was somewhere at a store. They picked it up and they went and spent their money or spent my money. You know what I mean? So let's see. So I'm about to go in the bank right now. Let's go. Alright, nah, so Alright Well, I'm back And so far So far what I've accomplished Is to go pull money out And then Right now, I got a dog that I got to take in because some dog, some random stray dog walked up on us last night. So I got to take that to the animal shelter because it's not mine. I'm not keeping it. I don't have space for two dogs. I ain't even going to lie to y'all. If it's like a little bitty puppy that I could train it or whatever and know it's like, um, know it. You know what I mean? I've been all right with it. I can't deal with two. I can't deal with a rando and get my own. So this is the dog. I'm going to show y'all that right now. So this is it right here. This is not my dog, y'all. I just walked up on us yesterday. And I'm about to take it to the shelter because I don't have space for it, and it is not mine. I'm not going to keep some dog and then get seen with it later. And have an issue around my house. So y'all can see this dog. It's been fed. So it's not going to be mean or nothing when the people get it. So y'all guys can see I'm petting it. It ain't mine though. It ain't mine. It's real friendly. So I'm going to take it in though. Alright. So they gave me this paper. I'm supposed to call the phone number. Um, yeah, I was not scammed or anything like that. I was not robbed. My fucking debit card either fell out my pocket when I walked away from the damn, um, the fuck is it? The sub checkout or whatever. You know what I'm talking about? Or, you know what I mean, probably was still a new machine. Who knows? Because at the end of the day, I guarantee right now that somebody sat here and picked that shit up. They looked dead at me and was like, 
Yeah, he right here. But let me go ahead and see if he has some money. Cause like I said, I went and bought a drink. I bought food and some drink. So that's the whole thing. The motherfucker watched me sit there. I was like, oh, he bought food to make some shit. Bought junk food or whatever he bought and some drink. I'm about to go do the same thing. This nigga went into the hood on the south side. That's why I be saying. That's why I be going over there. Because some of y'all be doing some rat bag shit. And y'all be seeing me too. Y'all be seeing me out in town. And y'all be scary as hell. Y'all don't, y'all don't. You know what I mean? Like I be having jury on. Y'all don't want to rob a motherfucker while they got their jury on. Or they got money on them. Or you think they got a gun on them. You sit here and play around. Sneak around and want to steal. That's what motherfuckers do. They don't get you when they know you got no money for real. They get you on some old petty messy shit. But that's how a lot of um, stars get killed. Because motherfuckers be watching them for days and just be looking at them. Be wanting to rob them. And get caught. That's why them people... I'm telling y'all. That's how this shit's going on. Motherfuckers sitting here seeing y'all out in public. I don't walk around no crew or nothing like that. I don't walk around no friends. No whole bunch of nobodies. I ain't out with my family or by myself. I'm not about to be acting like I'm scared of nobody. I ain't going to be scared of out no public. All that shit. But, yep. Yeah. So, they went all over there. I'm about to be over there in a minute. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I'm gonna drive around over there. I ain't even gonna flex. I'm about to drive around there two nights. Just see if I can catch somebody walking around with my car. Because, you know, people, they like going up to the desk. They like flexing but probably if the person see me they ain't gonna go up in the store though you know what i mean it's gonna be a situation in there but you know what like i said i'm gonna go ahead and report that shit because i'm gonna get that little bit of money back too and i'm gonna see if i can get money back just for the simple fact of i had to put 260 something back to whatever i had to do you know what i'm talking about Told y'all I'm a business owner too. So at the end of the day, the person probably looked at me, seen me talking about whatever I was talking about. Pick my card up. So we gonna see what's going on. I gotta call the um place right now. So that's what I'm about to do. Alright, so I'm gonna be real with y'all right now. They sat here after I called them. They said it was they said it was about like 312, 313. They said they got about 313 off that card. So what they are doing for me since I sat here and heard it and seen it and can verify all that stuff like that, like that. They gonna give me 312 back or something like that within like 12 hours. So that's a plus. And then another thing. I'm still making a police report. I'm still about to try to get the the three twelve off them. I ain't even gonna lie. I might get the 312 off them or get them booted up. You hear me? And then when they see me on public now, we friends. You know what I'm talking about? So whoever got my car last night, me and you friends now. So I'm going to go return that dog now since I got that little bit of taken care of. So, but I got to hurry up. So, catch on to me on this walk. Check me out. So I'm walking this dog to the animal shelter. And I feel bad about it, y'all. Like I could keep the dog and take care of it, but it's too much for Eli. That's the problem. Because when I'm gone, she's not to deal with it. I really feel bad. be honest with y'all so i could sit here and keep the dog but i don't want my wife to be mad uh things are already bad enough you know what i mean like like 
it's just too much. You know what I'm talking about? Like, I could live normal and free and shit like that. Like, fucking keep the dog. But I'd have to work harder and shut certain people off and do all this odd stuff. You know what I mean? Like, I would have to sit here and take time out from my normal job and then work harder on my business and then try to make projected numbers be a thing and then live off of it and that'd be a life decision made because of a dog oh and I got this wristband on I got a video about this wristband that's coming so I don't know which one's gonna hit first the video about this wristband or this dog and what's going on today but here we are at the animal shelter. And like I said, I feel bad as hell. I'm gonna get up in right here. Wow, and that's what they're full too. That's probably why they just let this dog go. They probably try to bring it in here. That was really sad. really sad Done this to us, we can only house 80 dogs, but we're at 115. 
So I'd have to play a little bit of dog catchers if there's any way we can make um, two-minute space for him. So let me double check with my manager here and let you know. Okay. All right. She's still trying to get me to say this is my dog, y'all. This is not my dog. That's crazy. Man, these people are really at me crazy. This is my dog in there. It's not my dog, y'all. That's real sad. I hope I got that on camera too that I just went through this. Oh, and I gotta go uh, make a police report that somebody has my debit card still. 
I don't even know what time it is. Let me check and see what time it is in a minute. All right. All right, well, I should have took a picture of the form that I wrote up because they tried to get me to admit that that was my dog and it was not. So I'm gonna have some more legal problems going on.